Happy Thursday. Hi, everyone. I'm trying to not be as quiet as last <laughs> time. Welcome to the Thursday video. If you celebrate Christmas, I hope you had a wonderful Christmas yesterday. And if not, a happy December 24th. Yes. 25th. 26th. Mm -hmm. Today's the 26th. Happy holiday season. Happy 26th of... I was literally going to say 26th of Christmas. <laughs> happy 26th of December. I were the Hallmark Channel, 26 days of Christmas. <laughs> so, this is a haul again. This is part two. We're going to try to not have three parts, but oh, no God. promises at all because we have a lot. It's going to be a big one. Like we said, this is literally some of the best things we've ever found. It seems like we always say that, but we always mean it. Somehow we always elevate, which is a great thing. Which is going to be depressing when we go when and we find, just like, trash. Find and we're like, we found these three things. So, <laughs> definitely want to see this. As usual, my email is the first thing below. If you're interested in anything at all, we give you guys the best deals. You can email me or mm -hmm. you can contact either of us through DMs on Instagram. Either works. And comments, free shipping. Comments don't work that great, but no. we always like to give you guys the best deals. So if you're interested, let us know. Yes. Sorry for the lighting. Sorry for the sound of the fireplace. This is all that we have to work with. We There's are. nowhere with good lighting in this household. We are on location in Jack's parents' basement because we're still prepping for Christmas Eve. You're seeing this after, but we're filming this on Sunday, the 22nd. 22nd. So mm -hmm. we're going to jump into it. Yeah. Let's show you what we no got. No more long talking. This has mainly been... And some we'll little, little bit of So this I forgot to put in the first one. This is a Pendleton wool hat. Very like Jurassic Indiana. Park. I was going to say Indiana Jones. Mm, the, one with the, this, the one with the whip. Mm -hmm. Never have found this brand, but I'm very excited to. I found it once. This is Privacy Please. I love how their little That's tag what the is a, looks like. Is a hotel thing. Yeah. Like, That's funny. That is size large. Cute. This is so soft. And this is Free People. This was a Bins find. This is a medium large. I didn't even notice that it was like a so variable I might take size. That. Very soft. Pretty sure it has wool in it, but it is like it's not itchy. Nice. This is a free people dress. I feel like I've sold this Size before. large. I have two, I think, in a different print. Yeah. This is a really cute print, though. It'd be good for Christmas, but it's over, so. But, so we'll just it's tag. Also it's good so. for spring. New and tag, size large. I love when you find larger size free people. And by larger, I mean, like, anything that is Yeah, anything small, that's not small. an extra small. <laughs> Whereas, this is a normal thrift store. This is Escada Sport. Escada cute denim jacket as With debbie says length. denim jackets are timeless which she's very correct she about is that. not wrong about cute that. little stitching down there little rope detail size 36 don't really know what that is so we'll call it medium this is a really good find so i'm gonna make you guys wait a little bit for that one this is from a normal thrift store this is free people size medium and it is a tunic it's like dress length but it's a tunic because it splits a lot what? And it's, it's sleeveless pretty. and it has it's the, really soft yeah little like turtleneck okay five first up for me is this free people little cami with the black you're not going to see these are like little black spaghetti straps um and his new tag and it is a size medium large perfect this is a bins find from today it is a theory size small petite little like kind of open knit sweater with this really cool kind of like crisscross back detail. Another bin sign from today, very excited. This is smart wool, size medium. Oh, oh thank God the fireplace just turned off, bless. It is this like striped kind of base layer, just little plain long sleeve top. I love when I find smart wool. Me too. This is another bin find. It is hot hippie, hot hippie, however you say it, medium large. Um, This definitely needs a good steam. Maybe a bleach just for good measure. Just a little kind of like open, like bateau, boat, however you say it. Okay, these are American Apparel, size 26. Um, the mom jean, I love finding American Apparel jeans. Just really cute little high-waisted. That's a high waist though. Damn. This is Anthropology. There's a dry clean check in the way. Anthropology J-O-A, which this brand isn't always an anthro, but I'm like 98% sure this one was. It is a size small and it's just this really pretty kind of like broken up plaid cardigan with the two pockets in the front because it's a cardigan. <laughs> okay, this is a newest tag free people size small. It is just a knit tank top. It was like in the dress section of this place I went to. So I was kind of hoping it was a dress, but it is not. And it actually has... It has some like it's on the like net. a flaw, yeah. some like kind of loose threads there, well, like, but it's not like 
currently unraveling. If you tell so. somebody to treat people, they'll go, oh. Size small. Because they always do that. Got three of these. Oh, I have one, so we'll just count. We'll, we'll just count, count that all as one. Cupcakes and cashmere. I have a size small, new without tag. I have a size medium, new with tag, and a size large, new with tag. Size small, new tag. So, new tag that's been ripped. Yes. Tag still tag. A majority of the things we're showing you are from the bins. There's a few things that are from this like consignment store that we go to. Gonna we also that. go to TJ Maxx sometimes and stuff. It's just, we go all over. This is smart wool. <laughs> this is a scarf. Like Ryan just said, we love to find like, smart wool. This I has some holes. Time. With scarves, Ooh. people don't always care. No. It's also like, it doesn't even almost go all the way through. Because I think smart wool is pretty thick. So. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Damn moths. This is... This is pretty. A, again... It's nicer to find a bigger size in this brand. It's a Madewell XXL. Heck yeah. Come on, size inclusivity. Really cute colors. This was from a regular thrift store. M Megashoni. If you don't know, Megashoni is extremely expensive. M Megashoni is sometimes at TJ's. This was at a thrift store. It has little bobbles all over it. This is a really cute sweater. It's thick too. It has a little bit of wool in it, There's but like hardly there. any. It's really nice. And it was a size medium. Just take a minute. I love this. It is a Patagonia. Oh, what are these called? Um, logos, I do believe. Um, Sherpa patterned, not hoodie, jacket. This thing is in amazing condition. It has the two pockets on the front and it is a women's small. These are kind of tangled. They are American Eagle size two. I'm see overalls, but they're very heavily distressed. Or what do you call these now? Yeah. Bibs? Overalls? They're really cute. And then just like plain in the back. These are Saturday Sunday Anthropology size. I hate how these size things are so small. Size medium. This little like chevron shorts. pajama shorts. Super cute. Are they pajama? I think so. They wouldn't have to be. No, no, no. You could definitely wear those out of the house. Usually Florida's is pajama, so they might not be. They're probably just like whatever you want them Comfortable to be. shorts. Okay, this is a new one to me. It is wooden ships and it is this cream, really pretty kind of like asymmetrical, I think. Think. With the ribbing going a different direction. Oh, yeah. Um, sweater, I do not know what size this is, but it looks to be, I'd probably say like medium large, and there's no tag in it. It might be one of those like one size sweaters. Um, this was right on top of those Everlane shoes from the last haul. It is an Everlane sweater, size medium. I know their sweaters have names, and I need to do a little bit more research. Um, it's just a green classic crew neck. We never find Everlane, so when we do, it's exciting. It is um, it pumped so up. Good. And it's kind of like a little bit of a more like olive. open knit. It is an olive color. So I found a bag, and whenever you find a bag in the bins, you're like, oh, awesome, donations. So it's <laughs> new tag Hannah Anderson, size 75. And then <laughs> one, two, new tags outfits from carter's and these were 26 dollars a piece and then Tights. hannah anderson leggings so some woman got these in a baby shower and then just donated them like they were, they were in, in the bag the gift bag that says like congratulations <laughs> um there was the hannah anderson gift receipt if anybody has a an 18 month old you can get a lot of stuff me up. i'll sell them all for we'll say 30 dollars for the whole thing okay me do that yes you five so I'm gonna count these as one because they're literally the literal exact same thing. Oh, we got J. Crew Mercantile, which is the new factory outlet. And then we've got actual J. Crew outlet. I think these were made a year apart, but they are the same style, same everything, same color. A cute. But different sizes. So if you're interested in this, it is a size 10 for one of them. And the other, this is what they zero. look like, by the way. They're really, they're really cute. Really cute. This is a zero. Good camel color coat. Even though, conspiracy theory. If you hold them up by each other, they look like they're the exact <laughs> same size. And they're literally on like the opposite sides of the spectrum. So that's hmm. fishy. Interesting. This is an amazing find, but I'm just throwing it in the middle of this. It's a St. John dress. I wasn't even gonna look at dresses, but Cue the, the corner of my eye caught this. Cute ruffles all over, and that's a definitely newer tag. It's from a normal the thrift store. The black with the right writing is the right new white writing. 
Is the newer, I don't know about so the newest. So is the yellow tag. The yellow one I think is the newest. This is a blank NYC, which everyone knows how much they're like moto jackets and all those jackets Lucky cost. Jeans. Doesn't always do super well for me. Oops, what this is that? confusing. Doesn't always do super well for me, but I thought this was like to die for cute. It's super pretty. With the pink, pink velvet. Pink velvet, little moto. Size small. You. Sometimes Free People sells them. That is not a Free People. Free People but... on Anthro. Yes. Google it if you find one. Reese, which thank you to our UK viewer, whose name I forgot. But you, thank you girly. tell us how to pronounce <laughs> these UK brands. This is really cute. It's really pretty. Um, Reese is really expensive, and it actually does pretty good for me. And this is a size UK 10 or US 6. Every time I go to this one particular thrift store, somebody walks out with a Reese glasses. Literally. It's kind of weird, but it's fun. <laughs> this... Oh, this is a Derek Lamb 10 Crosby, new with tag, retailed at $595 jumpsuit. It's so pretty. Like, this is the most classy, elegant thing. It's, it's missing so the, like, dumbbell from the middle one. The middle, like, little But chain. since it has the other two, and it actually is really? sewn down, it wouldn't make a difference. It's kind of just a visual detail. Yeah. And when they were, like, whatever this is they missed a little but if you had see Oop. it's like it was folded when they were like crossing out the name for some reason mm -hmm. size six if you got it dry cleaned that that could come out it just looks like marker. because usually and if like, there's marker on the tags i can use dish soap and get it out but i'm too nervous to try anything on this yeah we don't want but to trust me, to I garment. do believe it would come out. Ugh, up for me, this is probably going to go to Thread Up or somewhere that's not Poshmark. It is Eileen Fisher, size extra large. Um, just like your basic kind of, what material is this? Like stretchy blue long sleeve and there's no tag in it. Of course. Thanks, Eileen. These are Michael Stars, size small. Silk. Yeah, there's silk something in there. Uh, just like a really cute little gray pant, sweat pant maybe. With the little kind of roost waist. These are Athleta, size four. I love Athleta pants. They're just this like little pair of moto pants. They These need a cute. steam. A little, very like modern style. Yes, with a little jogger on the back and they have pockets. This I pick up every now and again just because like it's okay. It doesn't usually get me like a crazy amount of money. It is a Cote from Urban Outfitters, size medium, and it's just this like little velour. Crop Cute. top with the like spandexy thing in the front. These are Chaser, size Jeez. medium. Oh, it is pants. Um, and they're like really, Cute. really, really baggy pants. Comfortable. They would be so. I think they're supposed to be like perfect. Where I'm, like up here. Perfect for a reseller uh, Christmas when season. you're sitting yeah. at home, yeah. just working. If anybody wants them. Okay, this that was Wild Fox, but it is. Anthropology, which I'm very happy about. It is Project Social Tea. This is um, at Urban sometimes, but if you Google the... That can be Anthro? Mm-hmm. Weird. It looks like... Party one. Till Brunch. I don't know what the fascination with, like, brunch is, but, Who like... Who actually goes to lunch? I don't know. I'm too, like, okay, I want to eat lunch or I want to eat breakfast. I don't want, like... But I do want mimosas. So, like, <laughs> I will take care of mimosas. Um, and this is a size medium. And then, these are for Janet. They are cat oh. socks. And they I didn't like see those. Those are cute. You go around your little ankle. She will be a very happy woman. <laughs> she just got more cat socks, and she says, "Look at my toe beans." Every okay. time she wears them, it's funny. This I don't ever really get this brand, but I also don't find it too often. But at the bins, I'll get it. It's standard James purse, size two. It's also a lot cuter than they usually are. Usually, they're just like button ups or like t shirts. Okay, sorry for the noise. I'm cramming all this back in my cube bag. So I like never get either unbranded or like not a brand stuff, but I thought this was too dark. But like cute. when it's cute though. It's this tassely, fringy with like birds and flowers on the back. <laughs> little almost like Western style, like cardigan, but not a cardigan. It's, it's like, like a kimono. Yeah, it's a like kimono, a... like a shortened kimono. And it's called, it's by Forgotten grace if you know mm. what it is let me know it's a little or boutique brand cute i might know by the time this is edited and up but it's really cute it's i thought i'd take my chance this has no brand but this is so cute it's good quality too raspberry colored burgundy kind of velvet blazer and then the lining is floral i like it's i so was pretty. literally like this has to be anthro but there is not a brand or size 
to be found anywhere. Details to come later. At all. So I'd say medium. Yeah. It looks like a medium to me. Okay, this is a very strange, strange dress. It is a new tag. Alice and Olivia, which y'all know Alice and Olivia is cray cray expensive. She is $450. Come on, Mary Kate Nash. Black sleeveless. That's not. Oh, no, they do the row. Duh. Black sleeveless dress. It's like ribbed, and then there's just this like random little flag of black that hangs off down your leg. And it, it like, it's been stretched. A little. There like, too it's many not legs that trying bad. to get in there. Um, or she like kicked someone. She's like, <laughs> and, like but somebody. I don't know. That's the only flaw. And it's new with tags. So, it's like, pretty. I'll take it. This is IRO, which has been in a bolo. Bolo way back. So maybe some of you haven't seen it, but that is a bolo. It's pretty. This dress was like $450 originally. It's very cruise ship lady. I think nothing's really wrong with it. There's like maybe some makeup right there but i don't really want to wash this because iro is so expensive it's mm -hmm. probably dry clean only but if you dry cleaned it it'll come off and it yeah. was a size what 44 which i, I don't know what that means no damn idea what that means okay um welcome to the ikea bag you free people <laughs> in this swimsuit this is what is this philly q pilly q i have no idea um this is the lace fan four bikini bottom Cute new tags. This is a We the Free. I know what this shirt's called, but I can't remember. That um, looks slim. Wow. It's like it's supposed to be like tight. Like it's a tight fitting mm. t-shirt. Um, just like little basic kind of camo green t-shirt, and it is a size medium. I hate when they like spell out medium, and like just show me an M. Okay, this is really cute. I usually don't pick up this brand, but it is Loft by Ann Taylor. And I only got it because it has these pretty sleeves with this really pretty embroidery on it. That's cute. How go? We got ghosts in this damn house. Um, the size small. Pumped to find. Um, I have found this brand once in the past. And it was a play suit, much like this one. It is Keepsake the Label, which is wicked expensive. Um, this was $198 originally. New tags. And it's like... Okay, that's annoying. I think I might have seen that before you... You wear it like this, and then it's like... Okay. So imagine like... Because yes. it's kind of hard to hold up. I don't know why there's like a triangle in the middle. Um, And it's also a... That's a sleeve. A romper. romper. Or a play suit. I didn't realize that's what they're called now. Okay, one more. This is another free people sweater size medium. I have sold this one. It looks a little weird You in wear it like... Looks it a goes kind of like person, but with the model picture, yeah. it's a little more understandable. It makes sense. Um, this might be a little shrunk, but like I really wouldn't say it's anything too. Bad. Hi, Mike. If you hear a sniffing, if you it's hear a, a crunch and a. <laughs> so this Mike. is crazy strange, but crazy cute. This is a baby's backpack. Can I help you. Literally, this is a drawstring baby's backpack that looks like a cherry bunny. And it's it so is cute. Zara. This was in the bins. I don't even know why I checked it, but like I'm so glad I did. It even has an age, as if you couldn't just like give it to a kid. <laughs> it's size three to four years, but like. Why do I feel like three to you... four year olds are bigger than that? That's weird, okay. But that's really cute. I'm excited I found that. This is a North Face El Ducho. I mean, a North Face Denali. Um, this... Funny! And like a Hershey chocolate brown. And it is a woman's small. Mike literally just came down to get attention and now I can't stop petting him. <laughs> he will not let you. No. This is Moulinet Sours or Sours, however you want to say it. I don't speak freaking French. I don't know. Ruffle layered, <laughs> like pink, peach, whatever dress, size zero. I am taking Ryan's game. This is Fashion Nova, which fun fact, Fashion Nova was the most searched and sought after, most Google searched fashion brand of the year so they maybe that's also a good sign one of the worst <laughs> and it's a size 29 in the middle 29 of women's season. or 11 juniors these are this must be a vintage label i've never seen this label i actually had to like read it for like a good 30 seconds I was like what does that say it's club <laughs> monaco size eight. Oh, and there's no silk in it so i guess they could be washed probably hell yeah pants Love when you black can throw pants stuff in the but they're machine. like high waist so this is like where the leg starts um, first up for me, this is a bin find, and I knew this was expensive when I picked it up. Didn't Google it till I got home. I have no idea how to say this brand. Cavita Bajarita. Bajarita. B-H-A-R-T-I-A. Medium. Um, anthropology. 
super cute missing the slip but like you can just throw any little white dress underneath it and call her a day uh it says medium if i didn't say very pretty um this is a dreamers cardigan which i'm almost positive this was one of the cardigans that free people sells of this brand not 100 percent sure size small medium and it's just like a ribbed cardigan with the like tighter sleeves like a cocoon cardigan a cocoon cardigan if i do believe okay that's for janet um this might go in the second closet this will go in the second closet it is just made out of size small oh you did get that. um yeah it's cute just a little like crop top kind of multimedia little crop top uh brandy melville brandy melville is a company that's mm. what that is yeah Jean i picked that up and i made fun of it and i didn't even look at the brand <laughs> i said this is brandy melville and i right. was looking for something for a christmas party and i said just show up in this so a winter Christmas party. Okay, but in like Minnesota. it's one size and it stretches to Yeah. It fit a third of one of my legs. Well maybe like a half. Um <laughs> one size, so extra small. Little tube top. And I think we we're actually gonna cut, cut it, it short. Here. Oh. This is gonna be three parts, Damn. but that's okay. Because still haven't even shown you the best finds. No, we so not. come back. We still have a lot more. I just don't want this to be 30 minutes or more, probably even more. It would be more. But let us know in the future, are you okay with a super long haul? Do mm -hmm. you like it broken into parts? Sometimes it gives you like more to take in. Mm -hmm. Or like it's sometimes to it's too much to take in. <laughs> um, but yeah, we've got a ton more good stuff. Stay tuned Saturday, which is actually good because we wouldn't be able to make What's on Saturday because we've been on vacation mode. We have not sold a thing. So stay Literally. tuned Saturday. We're going to give you the last and third part of the haul, but it's going to be worth it. So you're definitely going to want to mm -hmm. see it. So subscribe, turn on notifications so you don't miss it. Let us Thanks know what your favorite. Up with us. Let us know what your favorite thing was from this part of the haul. Yes. And we'll see you on Saturday. Bye. Bye. <laughs>